In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Nearby Share for Windows. So with Nearby Share, it has never been easier to share files between your PC and your phone. So without wasting more time, let's get straight into it. So the first thing you have to do on your PC is go to your browser and then just search for Nearby Share in Windows. And then just click on the first link, which is on android.com. And from here, we can download the beta version of Nearby Share. So just click on Get Started with Beta. And as you can see, a file has gotten downloaded on my PC. So now I'll just open it. And now it's installed. So I'll just search for it in the Start menu. And as you can see, this app has come here. So now open it. And here you have two options. You can sign in if you want with your Google account or else you can continue without using an account. And the file transfer will work no matter which option you choose. So for now, I'll just sign in with my Google account. And here, as you can see, this is the dashboard. So first on top, I can name my PC. So currently it's this, but if I want to change it, I can just type anything I want over here. After that, I can decide who I want to receive files from. So under receiving, it's currently set on no one. But if I click on this, then just click on this drop down, then you can see the four options. So for now, I just select your devices. So this will allow me to transfer from my phone to my laptop. And now I'll go back. So here they've said that only devices which are signed into this email ID, I can share with them. So I'll just click on done. And now it's ready. As you can see, it's showing that it's ready to receive. And at the bottom, if I want to send files, then I can drop them over here. So now I'll move to my phone and show you how to enable nearby share on it. And the first thing I have to do is install the files app. So this is a Google app and you'll find it in the Play Store. So just install it if you haven't, and then open it. So now I've opened the app, and at the bottom right, you'll find an option called Nearby Share. So just click on this, and as you can see, we've reached a similar page as on our PC, where we have two options, to send or receive documents. So first I'll show you how to send a file from my phone to my PC. So on my phone, I'll just click on send. Then from here, I can select documents from my downloads, videos, apps, images. There are a lot of options on top. For now, I'll just send an image. So I'll click on images. And let's say I want to send the top three images. So I'll just select them. After that, I'll click on next. That's at the bottom. Then I need to turn on nearby share. And one thing you'll have to make sure is that you've signed in with the same account. So you'll find the icon over here. So here, as you can see, it's found my laptop. And to send the images, I'll just click on my laptop. Now it's connecting. So now everything is ready from my phone. And all I have to do is go to my laptop and click on accept. So here, I've come to my laptop and I just received this notification. So if I click on accept, now, as you can see, it's downloading the three images and they've said it's saved in my downloads. So if I just click on open, as you can see, the image which I sent has come here. So this is basically how to send it. And the same way, if you want to send it from your PC to your phone, over here, I'll just click on select files, then click on send and select my phone's name. It's as simple as that. Now I'll quickly show you a couple of settings that you should know. So first on your laptop, you can decide where the files get saved. So if you just click on settings, that's on the top right. Then the second option is save received files to, and I can change the destination. So if I click on change, then here I can decide where I want to save the files. So this is basically how it works. And if you want to know, five methods to transfer files 
between your phone and PC, then you can check out this video over here. That's it for today. Goodbye.